That technical foul came with very little time gone in the third period. Well, there are a bunch of good athletes in this competition, and they like this crowd. They like the enthusiasm. They're responding to it. All right, now here's the first one where we have two wrestlers closely ranked. They're very closely matched. John Smith of the Cowboys on the left, ranked number one. Greg Randall of the Hawkeyes now on the left, ranked number three. He finished second in the Nationals last year. And they're only sophomores. Randall is in. He's in deep. And now both these boys are outstanding prep careers. And part of the reason is because they're, they're such good athletes, not because it's technical work. They, they just have great athletic talent. Balance, power, strength. Well, that one took place out of bounds. It looked great, though, and it sure was a hard effort by Davis. This Seems to be John booze, Smith. Booze about everything tonight, Doug. There's an outside single, but it didn't really penetrate much. It kind of went down. There's a duck under attempt by Smith, and his was the same. It went down, but it didn't penetrate in. Here it is, same night coverage of Oklahoma State and Iowa from Carver Hawkeye Arena. I'm Doug Brown, and Chuck Patton is the man with the ideas here. He's the former coach of University of Northern Iowa. Oh, Randall gets the first touchdown. Well, Smith was going to try that head snap that he tried earlier to pop uh, Randall down to the mat, and Randall just slipped it and then came right in behind it. And he's been very tough on Smith on the edge of the mat. Uh oh, Smith hurt his hurt. shoulder. Well, that, you know, that happens sometimes in a big meet like this. A lot of tough competition, and uh, he's going to take it easy and see how that happened. See, here he tries to snap, and Randall just drives his hips up over top and slips the head out, comes in behind for the two-point takedown. He's got him wound up real tight right here. You know, he's in a good position to try to drive him over, and as Smith gets out of this, Randall picks him up. See, so they come up, and Randall still has control. Now watch him just lift the hips. Right here, he lifts the hips, he still has the arm, and he lands right on the point of that shoulder. Ooh. A lot of separations happen that yeah, it's way. That's a lot of times you're right. Those uh, separations you've seen many times in wrestling meets. Uh, landing on a shoulder, it hurts again. He's going to come back. I think he might have popped it out. It uh -oh. just uh, came down right on the point of that shoulder. In fact, I saw his... Read his lips, he said it popped. Something popped. Yep. Last year, he, as a freshman, was ranked very high at 126, went into the Nationals, I think ranked third, wasn't it, Chuck? I think he was seated third, and then and he got upset. bumped somehow yeah. in the second round. Oh, man, he's still having trouble. He's the brother of Leroy Smith, a wrestling family from Dell City, Oklahoma. Let's see it Watch again. It. See, here he is, and now he picks the crotch, and that lifting of the hips. Now, he still has the arm out in front, and watch him come right Ooh. on the point of the shoulder, right there. Right on the point. With all of his weight, all of Randall's weight, and all the drive of the move. Those are the way things have gone in five years for Iowa against Iowa State, Oklahoma, Oklahoma State, and Oklahoma, the only losses they've had in five years. It's an unbelievable run, isn't it? It sure is. Two to nothing. Now you're seeing Smith on the bottom, back wrestling again. That was his wizard arm there, and I'm not sure. I don't think he's going to keep this going. He only has two minutes of injury time, and he just isn't going to be able to use that. Uh, it's, it really hurt. It's really troubling him, too, because he's a... He's a wonderful wrestler, and he doesn't want to quit. Now, see how heartbroken he is. He knows there's something seriously wrong with his shoulder. He can't. Yeah, he got separated. That's a real tough time of the year for that, too, Doug. Oh, yeah, he knows. He knows, and that's one of the things that probably is bothering him right now. And you see that pain in the face. It isn't just losing this match, but if this is the lead-up to the national championships every athlete aspires for in their entire life. Chance to come in and go in there healthy may be lost right now. So that's that heartbreak that's bothering him. And it's a default. Randall, it's the same as a pin. And so the Hawkeyes get some help here. They go up 12 to 3. Randall was leading 2 to nothing. 
when the injury took place. Greg Randall, the winner by default in the first period. I didn't get the time, but it was not very far into the match. No, it's really one of those unfortunate things, as I said. Now, here's Young Smith. They're going to try to get an ice bag, and they'll put that on there to 